Hey everybody, Zach Fernandez, Zach Fernandez Night 2 here, back with unboxings for guys today. There's going to be four unboxings as soon as I can get them uploaded, and maybe another VHS video, but found this at my local store with some birthday money I just got. I was able to get these four things, and then also the other stuff that's going to be in the next videos, um, which this one's going to be for the 2022 re-release of um, Krang from the, you know, reissues of the TMNT classic figures from the 80s and 90s. I mean, like I said, this one I was debating on for a long time. Comes with his weapons, this stupid sticker, mainly because it's based off a movie I don't care for. There's the back. Sorry if I'm in the light. I only have of those villains, just the bottom three and then now Krang. Don't have Shredder or Leatherhead. Pretty much why I have these guys out here, because this is from previous releases. And then I'll be doing the same thing for the next two um, two figures. And then the newest figure that I have that's last will be a completely new figure. But I'm going to pause this and be right back. All right, I'm back. I got him out of the packaging. I want to show you the package without the figure in it. And then we got the figure still in here. I cut the ties, so it makes it easier for me to get this out. Looks like he has robot arms, a gun, and some type of like tether piece that's actually very flexible plastic. I think it's very flexible. Then we got the gun that comes with it, but mine looks a little warped because it's probably been in the packaging for a bit. But yeah, their st our store got more of these uh, reissue figures. So we got Crane himself. Alright. We got Crane right here. But this can lift up to get Crane out of there. And then we got his walker. Which has this really nice little plastic kind of lid. He has articulation, it's limited, but it still has articulation. Let's see if I can get it straightened. As much as I can, anyways. Oh, where at? Might be a hard figure to stand, though. Let's see if I can get his arms on. Honestly, not sure where this tube's supposed to go. Was it supposed to attach to the gun? You know, I'm not really sure where the tube is supposed to be going. Hmm. Not really sure at all, to be honest. Don't really see an available spot for it to go in. But we at least got his gun that we can place in his hand. There we go. We got Crane and his walker. Looks very nice. I like how he looks. Just not really sure where this is supposed to go. I mean, I don't really see a spot where this can pop on. Maybe it's supposed to attach to the gun? Just not sure where it's supposed to end up afterwards. Oh, I see. I think. There's like a hole in the bottom. I think it's supposed to go like, go like this to my to my knowledge. That could be wrong, but it looks accurate. But let's see if you can stand though. Mm, kind of yes and kind of no. Probably have to mess with his articulation here shortly. 
to get them to stand properly, probably. Well, for now, this is probably like his best way he can stand. But tell me in the comments below what you guys or girls think of this video. What do you think of the Krang figure? I think he's actually cooler than I was expecting. But I'd probably have to, you know, mess with him a little bit more um, in order to get um, him to probably a better position. But see you next time, and God bless.